Hey YouTube, what's going on? John here. Today I want to show you an app for the iPhone called PaceBot. And what this is, is a clipboard for your iPhone. Now if you're like me and you're away from your uh, desktop or laptop computer a lot and you're using your iPhone a lot um, and you find stuff on the internet, uh, pictures, text, stories that you want to save for later, then this is going to be a great app for you. Now, here we are on the main screen, and what you have here is you have your clipboard right here, which is where you can paste your stuff to once you copy it from whatever source you're going to. You also have uh, folders. I have folders here, um, and you can uh, add folders just by hitting edit, and then we'll, we can add a folder called test right here and save it. You can add as whatever folders you want, name them whatever you want. Um, in the settings here, you can actually uh, select your import location. So right now it's at the clipboard. I can set it to any different folder that I want to, but we'll leave it there as the clipboard. So we'll go in here. There's nothing in here right now, but I'll show you what you do here. Let's go to the internet, and this is the PaceBot website. Now you can copy text or images. So this image right over here, I'll select this one and say I want to copy it. Now you've done, you've copied it, now you gotta go back to the PasteBot application and it'll automatically paste it in there to the to the clipboard. Now let's go back to the website and let's try to select some text. Let's select uh, this block of text right here and we'll go ahead and hit copy and we'll go back in here and see it pastes it right into the clipboard. Now if you want to move this to a different folder, you're able to go in into it and by just selecting the uh, section of uh, either picture or text that you want to move, you can select this and then you can either duplicate that clip or you can move it to a folder so that we can move this one to any of our different folders here. I'm not going to do that, but then you can cancel. Or there's many other different options you can do here. You can select this button here and you can search uh, that text via Google. You can send as an email or you can s send uh, as a text message. There's also a free add-on uh, application for the Mac, Mac only, that will allow you to uh, paste it to your uh, say uh, your pages or your text editor or say you're in Google and you want to paste it there. Anywhere you want to insert text on your computer. Um, so I'm going to cut this video right now and then I'll catch you back when I've turned my computer on and I'll show you how it works on the Mac. Now I'm back and I've got my computer on. I have a pages blank pages document open and what I'm going to show you now is how you can use the free application for the Mac uh, to paste into any text edit software or anywhere you can insert text or a picture. Now what we're going to do here is we're going to click on this text here and where you would go to send it as email you see an option to paste to Mac and what you're going to see here is I'll click paste to Mac and then all that text was pasted on onto my pages document now we can try also here with this image we'll paste this image to my Mac and there we go the image is pasted to my pages document the PasteBot app for the iPhone is $4.99 I believe in the App Store. It might be $3.99. I think it's $4.99 though. But and then you have the add-on for the Mac only, which is which is a free download. So if you have any comments or questions about this app, leave those down below. Don't forget to follow me on Twitter at MacForLife83. Uh, don't forget to check out my website MacintoshForLife.com and hit that subscribe button up at the top if you want to be notified of my latest videos. And we'll catch you guys next time. Another thing I almost forgot to tell you was you can you can actually copy from your Mac to the PaceBot application. So say you're on your desktop, your laptop, you can uh, and you find an article or an image that you want to save, you can copy that back to the PaceBot application. The application has to be open on your iPhone to do this. And I've typed a little message here on into my in a Pages document, and I will copy that. We'll click copy, and as you can see, it pastes right into the PasteBot applications, so you can do that as well.